Okay, welcome back to another episode of Vault Hunters Plus 1.16.5. This episode has taken me so long to prepare, and I'm still working on it. But I've been working on this for the past uh, probably about 40 minutes-ish, 45 minutes. Uh, by I say super long, it's literally just been this. It's super boring, super tedious, and it's just to try and get a singular modifier on these guys. Which what we need right now is we're looking for Odyssey... And it's a modifier that will give us an additional 50% uh, artifact chance, which will add up in total plus the normal 5%. If you have Journey, Exploration, Odyssey, you will have a 95% chance of getting an artifact. So, fingers crossed we can get it on these last two. It is taking a long time, but I think we'll be able to get it done and we'll be able to run these five... So I'll see you guys once we get that taken care of, because this is going to be a interesting and long process for very little return, but I think it might be worth it. So I will see you guys momentarily. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. It's been like another hour of time. I finally have all five. So we're going to run these. We're going to see what we can get from them. Ideally, we will get an artifact out of each of these guys, but as the odds aren't exactly perfect, the chances are that we're not really going to necessarily. So, fingers crossed, and I'll see you at the end of this vault, where hopefully we get what we need. Okay, that vault complete. Let's see if we did end up actually getting ourselves an artifact there is a 95 percent chance so ideally we do what realistically i've hit that five percent before so i mean we'll find out okay we hit it that's good that's good so one artifact down four more to see if we get let's see will we get one from this vault because Okay, thankfully it is a find the obelisks vault because this will be a lot quicker and I won't have to just go out and try and slay as many mobs as I can. I also probably should just bring uh, certain objects with me at all times like mob eggs and such, but didn't really think that far ahead because scavenger hunt vaults I don't really think about too often. But I guess that's our third scavenger vault that we've done this entire series. Which is kind of crazy. And honestly, this would be an epic speedrun vault if we, uh, if we had the opportunity for it to be a speedrun vault. Because I'm pretty lucky when it comes down to the, uh, the first couple obelisk spawns, at least. Doesn't look like the last one spawned. In a very convenient place, but that's fine. Cause no no rush for this guy. Just trying to get there eventually. Just trying to chill. Have a good time. Absolute vibin'. And now we go. We're here. We get the robot. And fingers crossed that there will be a artifact in here. Cause if not. I'll be a little bit bummed, but again, 95% chance that there is, so I'm betting on that 95% chance every day of the week. Come on now. Please, please, please. Okay, good, good, good. We got the artifact in that guy as well. Perfect. We have two unidentified artifacts so far with three more of these guys to go. Let's do it. Let's see what we can end up getting. Okay, that vault relatively quick, taken care of. Let's see, will we get the artifact in here? Come on, come on now, fingers crossed. I believe, I believe. Please, please, please. Please, just, just, just be there, please. I'm so tired, it's been such a long day, thank you. I almost opened that guy immediately on accident. Okay. Now, two more to go. Let's see, will we get an artifact from these last two? Only time will tell. Let's see, can we get this guy in a speed run? And no speed run, unfortunately. Because for a good speed run, you need to kind of chain off of at least one within the first couple of rooms. And shoot, actually, this would have been a banger speed run. 
but alas, it is not a raffle vault. So there's no reason to actually speed run it, but I would like to get this guy done because I need to get some sleep after this. I stay up way too late recording videos. Yes, perfect. So I just needed enough videos for the uh, for the next couple days while I'm working and everything. So perfect, boss completed. One more, and we'll open the last two up together. Let's see what we'll end up getting. Okay, last vault. Let's do this. Come on now, three obelisks again. Why do we only get good obelisks when we're not doing speedrun attempts? Let's be real. Why? Wait, what's going on? Is something something fishy's going on there. Because I, I feel like every time it's like, oh, you're running a non speedrun vault? Oh, maybe we'll give you better odds at getting low, low amounts of, uh, of obelisks. I don't know. It's just annoying because no matter what I do, it feels like everything is just going down the drain. So please... Please make sure to like this video if you enjoy it because I do stupid things like this every single day and I really appreciate being able to do this kind of thing and I'd love to make it a career but as of right now I can't so if there's any way that any of you guys could support me in this that would be dope. I'd really appreciate it and uh, if you want to the best way to actually support me other than liking, commenting, and subscribing is becoming a YouTube member. So it costs like a little bit a month. I, don't, I forget whether I have it set to three or five dollars, but essentially it's just that. And you'll get to see my videos as soon as I upload them, which is pretty much after I record them within at least 12 hours, they'll get uploaded. So yeah, no, it's pretty, it's pretty quick. And you guys will get to see a couple days ahead, maybe uh, maybe a week ahead. Depends on how many, uh, how much of a backlog I have. But I'm trying to work on getting more of a backlog for the people who are wanting to become members to actually have and get something from it. So please, if you do want that, leave it in the comments and also become a member. And I will uh, have more content to post for that. So thank you. Oh, so I'm yawning again because I'm exhausted, but the show must go on. We're going to do this real quick. Last two. Did we get artifacts in both of them? Artifact and artifact. Okay. So that means we got five artifacts to roll for these guys. Let's see if we get any duplicates. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. I know for sure that at least two of them are not in dupes. But it looks like the rest of them are dupes. So that means that we have a total, a grand, grand total. Actually, uh, apparently one of them is a one of them is a dupe, but it's fine. It's fine. So that means we've got four, uh, twenty of the twenty-five complete artifacts, which is really, really close. That's amazing. So uh, yeah, that's gonna be the end of this episode. GG's. Peace. Have a great day. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.